Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the Proverbs 33 in chapter 12, 22. Chapter 22 is about God's law. We can see, look at this system. We have a long cylindrical shell. The runners are not is given, length L is given, right? And we find the charge uniform surface charge density is the phi. We need to determine the electric field dense at different locations. So for this one, we can see if this is outside the cylindrical uh, object, we can see the R is larger than R0, R is larger than R0, we can draw a Gaussian surface look like this one. Agree? Yes. And then we find the electric field times the Gaussian surface. So this is cylindrical. So the lens, the Length for this circle is 2 pi r times l in the surface at this region. The electric field is just outward, outward, and there is no electric field that's horizontal, so this surface don't consider, this surface don't consider. So e times 2 pi r l equal to enclosed charge divided by epsilon naught. Agree? So we can write the e as this one. Enclosed charge divided by 2 pi epsilon naught not RL. So for first case, we talk about R is larger than R0. So outside of the cylindrical shells, we can get the enclosed charge. As we consider the enclosed charge is just at this region, the surface is surrounded by this Gaussian surface, right? So we use charge density times the surface enclosed. That is a phi times the charge surface is 2 pi r naught, 2 pi r naught. So this is just the charge, the circle, right? The length on this circle times the L. See? Now we input this enclosed charge inside. You can see 2 pi, 2 pi, L, L cancelled. We get the answer look like this one. This is radically outward. The second one asks you the inside this is a cylindrical shell. So that means we can still draw a Gaussian surface inside of it. So is there any enclosed charge? No, right? So the enclosed charge is zero. So the E equal to zero. The third one asks you to compare the result for a long line of charge. And so this one we can see, we just talk about outside of this cylindrical shell, the electric field is equal to this one. And we know in previous, the field is for a long line of charge equal to this one, right? You can check your test book. See, if we consider this R0 is much, much smaller than L, we can consider this cylindrical shell is a long line non line of charge, agree? So these two equals. If these two equals, we can get the lambda. This is the linear charge density as 2 pi phi times r naught, right? You can see r is the ch surface charge density. 2 pi r naught is the length for this circle. And if we consider this is a long line shell, the L can be be considered as one, right? So the linear charge density equal to the surface charge density times the two pi r naught. Thank you.